With a time of 7 minutes and 40.7 seconds, the new Audi RS3 sedan is the fastest compact model on the Nürburgring Nordschleife. In June, Audi Sport Racing and development driver Frank Stippler beat the previous lap record in that class by 4.64 seconds. Above all, the torque splitter, with its fully variable torque distribution on the rear axle, contributed to the record time. The basis for the record is the interplay of top technologies. For the first time ever, a torque splitter is being used in an Audi model. It distributes torque fully adjustably between the rear wheels, controlled via a multiple disc clutch on each of the drive shafts. During dynamic driving, it increases the drive torque to the outer rear wheel with the higher wheel load. This means that on right turns, there is more torque on the left rear wheel and the opposite on left turns. The RS3 therefore turns into the curve even better and follows the steering angle more precisely. In general, the new RS3 is much more agile when driving from the middle of the curve to its end and when accelerating out of the curve. So let, let's start. Yesterday we arrived here in Moisbad and uh, I was very excited. So goosebumps everywhere. And it's one of the biggest and greatest day in my career, to be honest, because our team uh, worked three and a half years just for this day, more or less, to be honest. <laughs> and uh, yeah, we, we can be proud of it because we are faster, four seconds faster than the current record holder. And the, the, the team did a great job. To be honest, it's, uh, I'm very proud of them. Tire pressure, we could, we could optimize, of course. Yeah, there were uh, 0.2 bars, more or less optimization within uh, the stints, and 
we, we got the best lap then with the best conditions and with the best tire pressure and it was awesome and the RS performance mode with the uh, semi slicks worked very well and uh, Frank did a great job and <laughs> did the record of course. <laughs> So of course the five cylinder, the five cylinder right now we belongs to in the RS3. 400 horsepower, 500 torque, 20 uh, Newton meters more than the predecessor. And uh, a lot of best in class, to be honest, 3.8 seconds from the Euro 100, 290 kilometers at its best. And of course, 7.40.748 seconds on the green hell. And right now we're number one and the green hell. We fine-tuned the car um, uh, over the distance now, over the laps, um, and in the very end it was on a very high level, um, very neutral car. Um, we tried to balance it by uh, fine-tuning um, of the tire pressure, um, by fine-tuning of uh, the moment of the rear axle um, regarding the torque splitter, and finally um, I think we, we put every, every effort together um, into, the, into the best possible lap time, and um, we were very happy um, that we did so. We've got the torque splitter in the rear. Um, uh, we, we are able to adjust some oversteering. Um, we reduced um, the understeering to the max. Um, it's a very neutral car and um, if you want to, you can even have a, a, a massive oversteering car um, regarding the torque rear uh, adjustment, for example. Um, so uh, I think for me, it's the, for the very first time a car um, which, which is uh, so much enjoyable as, as no Audi uh, before regarding this oversteering moment. Thank for watching. Subscribe to Real Wheels Arena.